Jonathan Taves, three Stanley Cups, two Olympic gold medals. Before he was named captain in Chicago in 2008, they didn't even have a captain. The rivalry has to resume sometime, and that time is now. Score! And a meaningful silence brought on by these guys. better to play from in front than to chase the game. There's the game's first goal. Chicago's got the first one. Boy, I saw this coming. They had the momentum. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Chicago's moving the puck up the wing. Jonathan Laid on to Saad. Decides to head for the corner. Skilled play by Saad. On to Zebra. Tries to get it on net. Just missed the net. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Throws it to Zebra. Sideboard play forming. Let's it go. Got a piece of that one. Pulls the trigger. And on top of that, another great stop. I'm not sure how he stopped that first one. On back to Keith. Throws it in front. Saved with the pad. Collected in the corner. Pass to the blue line. Back at the blue line. Back to the blue line. Presses that attack. surprises everybody with that quick release and he's got himself a good goal oh i thought he had that that puck looked like it had been stopped but it leaked his way through and gets into the net it's a face-off win may not seem important in that territory but they have possession by number eight nick schmaltz and by number 19 Snaps the shot. Save. Six minutes, 27 seconds. Chicago's in possession and moving up the wing. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Steps across that line. That puck went loose off the enemy. The Blackhawks keep the play going in the middle. It's all on his shoulders. Marvelous save. All those glorious moves, not enough. And yet another save. How does he do that? This game has had great pace to it. There's not been very many whistles, which, as broadcasters, we like a lot. But there is going to be a lot of chances from play like this. The Hawks with possession up the wing. Gathered up again by Patrick Kane. Terrific determination by Gagne. Has that point pass as well. And a save! Crawford's made a textbook stop here. He's in good shape positionally. He makes the save and he makes it look really easy. Cooper's got it. Let's the shot fly. Wonderful stop by Crawford.
Chicago's got a face-off win. Good pass, and he looks ahead from the right wing. He's got that point pass. A long scorcher! Is right behind the net now. Did what he's paid to do. And he holds on, and the whistle stops playing. A little under five minutes left to go in the period. The Hawks are ahead, two to nothing. Chicago's quick on the draw. Sticked away, oh, that was hard to follow. The Canucks up the wing are moving the puck. Fires, save! Good kick of the puck by Erickson. Skill play by Saab. Chicago's winging it at neutral ice. Back to the point. Good place to shoot from. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. This is frustrating. The goaltender makes a save by getting just a chunk of the shot. Vancouver's got a defensive zone win. The Canucks skated up on the side. To the point it comes. The clock leads down to the last minute. Brings it in for an attack. In the first period. Good position in the slot. He scores! Three in a row! You're in the low slot and a puck's on the backhand, you gotta react quickly. It was close. That's a good shot. He looked like he was in position to make the save, but he got just a small piece of it. The Hawks win that neutral zone faceoff. Skates it into the zone. Has a chance to make a play through the corner. That's a good defensive stick there. Birchie's trying to do way too much there with that offensive opportunity. Period one is over. A dominant period for one squad. Your thoughts on the first? Chicago's lead has resulted in strong puck possession in the first. They'll be looking to continue executing on their game plan as we head into the second. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. He's got that pass at the point. Really solid job done defensively. That takes some of the pressure off when you can use your stick like that. Moving it to Saad. And so there's an icing on this play. Horvath's pickpocketed again on the draw. A long day, no cash left, team behind. Back and forth they go between the points. Broke it right up! Left wing pass to Berchi. Steps in from the neutral zone. Feeds the point. Smart recovery by Duncan Keith. Chicago's in possession as they travel up the wing. Perfect, Grister! Oh, what a save that was. Vancouver's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Cuts off the passing lane in the defensive zone. Looking to Anisimov. Driving in from no man's land. Terrific fake out. Nice work by Anisimov. Goalie's one of the six guys on the ice. He can pass. He did that. And they are in. Fires. Save there. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. 
That's not really a scoring chance. It's a puck to the net. The goalie gets to handle it and stop it, but not a challenging stop at all. The Canucks prevail again. Nicely received at the point. He turned it. Save. And he puts the glove on it and stops the play. Critical face-off win there. A shot. Save. The Blackhawks have been really solid defensively. Their goaltender has not had a very busy night at all. The shots have been few and far between, but he's been sharp when he's had to be. A little under nine minutes off the clock. It's a solid lead by a score of three to nothing. Using the point. Lots on that to Stetcher. In the slot. Gathered up again by Gagne. Shoots. Had it away. Can't get a shot on. Circles with it to Erickson. Sweeping motion to knock it down. Poked away. Puck controlled now by the defense. The Blackhawks possess the play in no man's land. Dogged determination there by Del Zala. Sent back out, and so more players can spill over the boards for the Canucks. Propelled to Keith. Passing one off now to Debrinkin. Chicago's along the wing at center ice. Shoots with no time whatsoever. He turned it aside. Now that's a solid save. Nicely into the zone. Let's it go. They can't find the target. That was a dangerous chance, but unfortunately, we... That one's off the frame. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Well, it looks like the shooter's just trying to get this puck on net. Routine stop for the goaltender, not much challenge. Clean win on the draw. Chicago starting back in the defensive zone. Directing that one to Saw. Carries it on in from center. Fires! The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Vancouver's up the wing controlling play now. Fires a shot. That's a great save. Picks it up back there. Pass attempt to Roussel. Clock about to bleed down to the final minute. In the second period. Chip to Edler. Gives it to the point. Shoots one. And a save. That's a good solid deep by Taves. Two periods have been played, and so, as we think back through the first two, we think ahead toward the third. The Canucks have been a bit frustrated, Doc, after two periods of play. They were down on the scoreboard. They have the prospects of a real hot goaltender in front of them. As their coach, I would tell them to stay with it. Eventually, you get one, and then you get another, and you'll be right back in this game. Up to the point. Slid to Debrinkin. A strong pad stop there. Vancouver's carrying it in the defensive zone. Pitching it to Berchi. Is able to move on in. Laid on to Tanev. May not have intended it, but it hit him. Sails it. Heaves one. Scores! Another step in the road back. They're down by two. A 
just had this feeling, Doc, that eventually, with all that work, they were gonna score. If you're gonna try and windmill this glove save, you better get it. Otherwise, you look like a little bit of a joker as this puck's behind you. Vancouver's goal gets them to within two. There is still time, thus there is still hope. It's a good thing. The Canucks control from the faceoff. On to Gagne. A textbook stick save. Chicago's looking to head man up the wing. Propelled to Schmaltz. Pitching this one to Erickson. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Heaves one. Gathered up again by Anisimov. Swept on to Zebra. A shot. Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. The goalie doesn't have to do much with this, but he's able to use his stick to make this save. A little under seven minutes have transpired in the period. Chicago's been strong. They've built a good lead, but it's recently been cut from three to two. Nervous time coming. He scores! They are off the mat fast. Sods had some chances in this game. He finally scores on the backhand. Markstrom's beat low on the glove side. That's a real quick release that he can't get to. Chicago's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. Blackhawks goal scored by number 20. Many yards gained to Debrinkin. By number 19, Jonathan Bates. And they've got it again. Seven minutes, 21 minutes. Snapping a pass to Berchi. Gains the zone. Flings it. Outstanding save with a glove. Horvath's dropped another draw, and it shows on the scoreboard. Gathered up by Saw. Just a backhand. Took care of that one. Blocked away. Chip to Debrinkin. Leads that charge into the zone. That's how you break up a play. And now it's directed to Berchi. Slid to Horvat. Smart recovery by Zebra. And he gains the zone. Laid on to Debrinkin. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. You gotta think that's a game-changing save there. Perfect save. It's an onside play. And it's off. That puck left the zone, and so everybody will have to reset. Up the left side to Erickson. The Blackhawks are at the wing in neutral ice. Shoots one. Padded away with authority. And still another save. What a show. Shot. Oh, a close call there. That's a great scoring chance, but he just missed. He'll be looking to get the next one. The Hawks have it up the wing. In front. Paddled aside. On to Kane. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. Fantastic setup and equally great stop by the goaltender. A shot. No time to react. Didn't need it. Save. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go.
Crawford's been the one key reason that his team's been able to hold on to this lead. He's faced a high percentage of top quality shots. He stopped virtually everything. Shoots, stared him down and made the save. Freezes play. As soon as the goaltender reads the release of the shot, he drops to the butterfly and makes a really easy stop. That's a solid face-off win. Save! We are in the 60th minute out of 60. It's dumped in. A shot. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. That was a good challenge. Better stop. Shoot. Wonderful stop. Good defensive read with that one. Nicely into the zone. Shoots it off. Waffle boarded. Rister from the slot. And he missed it. He's got lots of time and plenty of opportunity to create a dangerous chance because he's right in the middle of the ice. And he blows it by missing the net. Chicago's two-minute penalty is a minor and the call is hooking. This was okay about 10 years ago. Not anymore. That's a hooking call. Taves has another face-off win. Good night for him. Good keep at the line. More attack coming. The clock is at zeros. The game is over. And the buzzer sounds. This was surgical. You need good hands, Doc, to be a surgeon. They had good hands all night long.